Mark Auckland was diagnosed with chronic lymphocytic leukaemia in 2015, so has spent more than two years watching and waiting for treatment to begin. We call it watch and worry as a strapline, which is exactly what it is. So you're not going to get treated, they're going to wait to see how the, pa the disease pans out before they do, do anything. Patients aren't given treatment until their condition deteriorates, as chemotherapy can have serious side effects. For patients, they see that they're not being treated straight away. They've got a cancer, they want it out of them, but that's not happening. And then also, they don't know if they're going to be the third of patients who never require treatment, if they're going to need treatment within a few months, or if it's going to be 10 or so years before they require treatment. It is just that living with the uncertainty and living with the unknown that patients find really difficult. There are around 13,000 families like Mark's watching and waiting for treatment. Half of them say they feel more depressed and anxious since diagnosis. One in eight say that the wait has left them feeling constantly depressed and anxious. For Mark, the support he's had from his family since his diagnosis has been a massive help. We talk to each other a lot. We listen. Mark does a lot of research and he passes it on and we share that research. Um, we talk to each other and it has been a very positive experience for us. So I'm trying to do my bit to raise awareness. And I Mark's now part of a national campaign from Leukaemia Care. I think the carers don't get enough attention either because your loved ones who are supporting you, it's quite a trial for them because they're on the watch and wait and they don't know what's going to happen in there. He's hoping this campaign will cut the worry for others that are waiting. Andy Holmes, BBC South Today.